26. What? How did we get 26 from that battle? Okay, what is this? My teleport button is not working. Hello, and welcome back to another bot class video. Yeah, look at this. We are top two now. We have went back to top two. 1.26 trillion let's go let's look at our power so we have three brews we max it all out which is really really good anyway that's not part of the video <laughs> this video i want to show you how you can get most or all of the items that are in the summer events okay so let's just get started for the summer event it will last 14 days um one day has already gone by so there's only 13 days left for you i'll show you how to get all of these things during the summer event in the best way the most efficient way to get them so you can earn all of the items that are in the event and you won't be missing anything first let's read this so we get the clear idea of what we're dealing with okay so we are supposed to collect all of these items we are just gonna read the bottom thing here event item sources so you can get watermelon from war enemies and then the drink you can get it from online reward or the wheel of fortune okay and then the ice cream cone you can get from the chest in the crypt so those are the only ways you will be getting these things in the summer event let's start with watermelon here since this is the most easiest thing to understand and the easiest one that we can get by just you know afk you can get them from just killing these stuff so let's kill one of the elites and see yes look at that one 26 what how did we get 26 from that battle wow that's amazing we just got 26 water mana from that one elite wow okay we got one from that one okay <laughs> i have no idea how we got 26 from that but there you go that's exactly how you will be getting watermelons part and the summer event okay i just got one more piece it's not from elite it's from everything so you kill this thing you will get it too yeah, I just got one right there, but I don't know if the drop rate is lower, but it looks like the drop rate is a little bit lower for these non-elites. We got one again, let's go! I don't know if that's intentional or not, but the UIs are overlapping. The box and the watermelon, the UI are overlapping just like this. Yeah, they are overlapping. So I don't know what's behind that. Maybe they just screw up the number or something like that. I wish they don't overlap like that. I did not get this on uh, recording, but earlier I was leveling up my Bruce right here. And once it reached level 210, my auto summoning stopped. And there was a button on top of my squad power that says this select. So yes, this button right here. This button showed up not here but it shows up in my inventory here they just go over to my squad power so i don't know if that's a bug or not but it's gone for now i just close this reopen and i don't know i just keep closing reopen and then eventually it's gone but anyway that is exactly how you will be getting watermelon in the summer event okay next let's talk about the ice cream cone okay we're gonna get back to this later but let's talk about the ice cream cone let's go to the ice cream cone how you get the ice cream cone you can get it from the chest in the crypt okay let's go to the crypt okay what is this is this another bug i click my teleport and this thing pops up what my teleport this thing pops up wait what is going on okay let me click that okay bot clash <laughs> i just found another bug <laughs> clicking the teleport thing my summer event pops up okay let me change this and see if we're oh no it's still broken <laughs> okay what is this my teleport button is not working my teleport button is not working bot clash what are you doing what is this everything is working except my teleport button it keeps taking me to the summer event what what is this where's my teleport no okay let's go to the spaceship station instead and we will go to the desert ruin by this bot clash your game is broken fix the teleport ui is not popping up what is this for those of you that have not unlocked the desert ruin or the last region of desert ruin beating this lizard and going over here if you have not unlocked the crypt okay that's so much easier there is no oh Oh, okay, okay, my teleport work again. Okay, my teleport work. Okay, and um, since I got here, I don't need it anymore, huh? If you have not unlocked the crypt, there's no way for you getting the ice cream cone at all. So, let's go here. If you are in tier 1, you will get less ice cream. Tier 2, you will get more, and it goes from there. You get more as the tier goes up. So, let's go to tier 1 first and see how much ice cream cone we're gonna get. I'm gonna skip to level 2 so that we will get the box, and I will show you guys how much ice cream I get. Okay, we are at level 2, so I'm just gonna kill the boss and open it. We get 20. <gasps> oh my gosh, nice. We finally got the star bot. This is exactly what I wanted. 
so you will get two items now okay you will get your normal things that you always get and you will also get the ice cream for the summer event okay to prove that you will get more every single time you go up the crypt in the level when you go to level 3 you get more yes this one you got 30 so level 3 you get 30 okay we are at level 4 now and let's see how much you get you get 50 nice that's nice and you get a lower tier box i will put this in many people have say that when they do the crypt they get lower tier box tier one you get area five region three box and tier two i don't know what you get but you get the box according to the tier that you're doing in the crypt so let's leave and let's go to tier two just to prove that you get more every single time you go up a tier so let's skip to level two okay we are at level two and let's see how much ice cream we get Okay, yes, you get 40 now. On the previous tier 1, level 2, you get 20. And this one, you get 40. You get more ice cream according to the tier that you are doing, okay? And that is exactly how you get ice cream comb in the summer event. The last one is the coconut drink. Why I put this one at the last spot? You might not be able to get all the coconut drink you want to unlock everything that you needed in the summer event. Why? So for the watermelon, you just kill regular enemies and you get them one two three four five or you get 20 like me <laughs> so watermelon you can get an unlimited amount of watermelon all you do is just keep killing enemies and you will get them the ice cream comb is the same thing you just keep doing the crypt and every single time you open a chest you get a certain amount 20 30 40 to get 200 ice cream comb if you are doing tier 4 or tier 5 if you can beat tier 6 that's amazing you might get like 500 600 even 1000 at level 4 i don't know haven't beat it yet but watermelon and ice cream comb you can get an unlimited amount of the items you can get as much as you want for the coconut drink i did the calculation and if you only collect from the online rewards assuming you collect these every single day so each day you get 800 so collecting the items for 14 days you will get 11,200. okay so let's spin and see what we get Oh, we got damage boost look at that we did not get this 50 percent coconut drink so another assumption okay assuming you get these every single time you spin you get five spins per day assuming you get the coconuts five times like every single day you spin you always get coconut the maximum that you will get is seven thousand okay seven thousand for the wheels of fortune is the maximum that you will get assuming you don't spend any gems you just use a free five spin every day and you get this every single time you spend the maximum you will get is seven thousand you can get more if you use gem to spin it but i'm just doing this without spending any gems or nothing else okay seven thousand plus eleven thousand two hundred if you add those together the maximum you will get is eighteen thousand two hundred hundred by not using any gems okay why do you need to know this because if you add all of these up the milestone doesn't matter it's the total collection that you get so if you spend your items on these exchange stuff the number of the milestone does not go down at all let's do some more calculations here let's start with gems okay we are going to do the calculations for the coconut drinks because you can only get a limited amount of them without spending any gems the maximum you can get is 18,200 let's start with the gems here 100 times 5 because you can exchange it for 5 times so that's 500 right there and let's go down you want these two mythical arms so that's a total of 4,000 because you can only exchange it for one time each and that's a total of 4,500 and you want this box too okay you want that box so that's another 2,000 right there so it's 6,500 right now you can see in my calculators in the screen too and then let's go down a bit you want all of these mythical the head the mover and the back okay you want all of these so 1000 each and you can only do one time so that's a total of 3000 right there 9500 in total right now you get down to this mythical materials and you want to get all of them one mythical materials it costs 1000 coconut drinks you can exchange it for 10 times so that's 10 thousand okay if you do it for 10 times that's ten thousand. and look at this we have exceeded our maximum potential that we can get in the online rewards and we also fortune without spending any gems we already exceeded by 1300 let's continue so if you did not get the mech bow yet and you want that that will be another five thousand for the mech bow okay you will spend 5,000 coconut drinks for one mech bow if you want the pacer too that will be another 800
and this grab here it costs the coconut drink too so you can do it for 10 times and 500 coconut drinks each time you want the legendary the scrap or the legendary that are in your region 500 each and that's 5000 if you add all of that together your total coconut drinks will be 30,300. You might not get enough coconut drinks for every single part or every single things that you want in the summer event. So my best suggestions to you is only get the things that you really wanted. If you want the mech bow for collection or you want to use this, then you might want to save your coconut drinks for this. Watermelon and ice cream, it doesn't matter. Even though it costs 20,000, you can get these really easily because you can just keep doing the crypt over and over, over and over again. I wish they would add it to the daily reward too not much just 100 each day man so people will have this thing to check in every single day if you have enough legendaries then just don't get this one at all um this one is not worth it if you compare to other stuff and another suggestion from me is that if you have enough and you really wanted mythical parts for your mech then get all the mythical spurs don't get this okay don't get this get all your mythicals first and if you have more coconut left then you can get this near the end of the event my number one thing is that you want to get is this one you can only get it one time but it is so worth it you can just spend three days and you will get this box and you can claim this box and you will get one mythicals for free man this is like one of the best item in the summer event the next item that i would go for is definitely the arm here i think you can only get these arms in the summer event because it's limited time and these items are only in the event here they did not add it to the box let me just check yeah the top three i would get is this mythical box and the two arms because these three are very limited you can only do it once the event is gone you will never get this arm again i think gem it is very important too if you want you can get these but do you have two more choices by using watermelon or your ice cream cone to get this stuff so yeah use them and you will get 1000 for these two and if you have any extra left you want gems you can get an extra five 500 of these spend your coconut drink wisely these are perfect legendary parts if you have not unlocked these yet or you did not open these yet you only use these two the watermelon and the ice cream cone so that is very very good because you don't have to spend any coconut you can earn these by battling the crypt or just normal bots which is really amazing so yeah that's basically it about the summer event here and of course the milestone it doesn't matter you will get these no matter what if you just log in every single day you will get at least 11,000 and you will definitely get this coconut drink and you can unlock the mech if you log in every single day and collect the online reward every single day too man so yeah let's wrap this video up watermelon you can get unlimited of these by just battling normal bots and the ice cream cone you can get unlimited of it just by doing the crypt over and over again but coconut drink you can only get it from online reward and wheels of fortune 50 percent you getting this so assume you will get it every single time hey we got it let's go so now my maximum of the coconut drink has gone up by 100 yeah if you want things you didn't have before like the mythical part uh, these mythical materials i recommend you get these first before you get this one because even if you get these you don't have this so this is useless get the mythical box man mythical box is amazing i wish they would allow five of these man five of these would be amazing five of these make the ice cream cone cost 10,000 the watermelon cost 10,000 i don't care i will grind for it man definitely get these two because they might just be here for the summer event and once the summer event is gone it might be gone forever we don't know yet they might bring it back in the future but just get it and don't regret not getting these oh and another things that if you want to earn everything you can just buy this pass okay you can just buy this summer event booth and it costs 900 you can just buy this you will get two times of the reward so you will get about what 18,200 you will get about 36,400 assuming like i said earlier assuming you get these five times every single day and you collect all of these every single day your maximum potential might be 36,400 if you got the two times reward boost that'll be it for this summer event in bot clash i hope you guys enjoyed the video i know i definitely did enjoy making this video by calculating everything and it was such a fun video to make so if you guys enjoyed the video and i'll see you on my next video or stream bye bye